Hey, the whole- ow. The whole thing's at least, uh, barricaded. Uh, there's a- there's a rats in the- in the sausage gutter, which is also gross to think about. You pick up sausages? Okay, so there's a door over there. I can't grab the barrel. Kind of didn't expect to. Oh, do I have to mulch stuff myself? Oh, no. What are we doing right now to ourselves? Can I swing somewhere? I might be able to swing until I can reach those sausages on the left. Probably not. I made one sausage and then stopped. Can I open this little drain? Can't climb up there. Oh. No, that's as far as they'll go. Can't pull this. Hey! Huggies! Almost as good as not dying. Uh oh. Well. I thought I had to make like a- oh, do I have to load more meat? I think I have to load more meat so I can turn it into more sausage and then I'll get like a- I'll get like a ladder of sausages to- to jump to a sausage vine. Oh, uh, is it gonna be someone who's still alive? Well, at least I can destroy their collectibles. Take this only valuable thing in this place. That's what you get for being creepy nightmare monsters that murder people for some reason. I mean, for eating, presumably. Oh, are you eating that guy or is he just like passed out? You're not quite on his body at the moment. Oh, I cannot do that jump. A really weird perspective for the camera to take. I can't, I can't see anything. What are you asking me to do right now? Grab that guy? No? Ah. I gotta say, compared to, uh, out- Compared to Inside and Limbo, I find myself less sure of where I'm trying to go a lot more often in this game. I can't tell if like that, for example, is like, is that a puzzle? Or is that just like, ooh, look at this visual. Now leave, because this is a dead end. It might be a dead end. It might just be a sad, horrible visual. But for me, I'm like, oh, what's the solution here? Oh no, don't climb up that. No. Yeah, that's a bad idea, but I thought I'd try it and see what happens. Up here, perhaps? It is up here, isn't it? Yep. That's exactly what's going on. That entire room is just like a weird... Red herring. That's happened a few times now. Like, there's just entire rooms that seem like the way forward, but they're actually just, like, dead ends. And so I, I sit there and I try to solve a puzzle, but it doesn't exist. Hey, little guy. Don't worry, I'm just, I don't know, turning some of our brethren into meat. I mean, they were already meat. But I'm like turning them into like packaged, reconstituted meat, which is probably less good. 
All things considered. Is that all I get out of the entire thing? There's no way. You only get one sausage link out of an entire thing of meat? It's so small looking. Do I, I have more links to gather? Uh, the big nasty meat is what I need, isn't it? Oh, there's this one too. I bet you this one's not enough either. I bet you the big horrible looking one is what I need to succeed. Although this one would obey the rule of threes. I put in our third little... Honey ham of man. Man ham. Nope, get out. We'll see if rule of threes applies, otherwise, otherwise I have to dump that giant person thing. Flesh mob into the, uh, grinder. Oh, look. I don't know what I'm gonna do with this. Hello, do you want to eat? You shouldn't eat it, probably. Gross. <laughs> Gross, that sound. The things I do for love. To see if that's enough. Hip. It's enough. I don't have to t do the horrible thing over there. Okay. I'll continue hating myself, but in like in a different room that smells differently. Not better, just differently. Oh, well, this is where I live now. We're in the freezer. Oh, this is bad. This is not at all good. This is just a, a grand sum of human suffering. I bet you someone comes onto this elevator. I'm just gonna run right now. Cause there's like a hiding spot over here. Yep. I know how you do, game. And then one- oh, please don't check here. Yes, the cheese. The moldy butt cheese. Keep it in my butt. Fuck you! Go, 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 go. Uh. He's gonna follow me, isn't he? I gotta go, because he's gonna be on the next one. So go, 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 go. I can't press that button at this height. I think I need to throw something at it. Oh, it's a dead end. I need him to. Pr He's gonna press the button, isn't he? I need him to press the button so I can continue. Yep. So our quest is to find a key, get back on the elevator, then use it immediately, because we're going to be pursued. <clears throat> pursued. There's the key. Of course. Maybe I can use the next room to distract him? Oh, that looks really gross. Uh, uh. There's some really messed up details put into how they process some of that stuff. Ah, oh, crap, really? Crap. Gotta figure out the stealth mechanics of this game. The funny thing is, like, in Limbo, and it's not even really funny. In Limbo and Inside, people get horribly, horribly murdered in graphic ways, usually. In this game, you don't get murdered in graphic ways, you just get grabbed. But the whole level, the entire environment is constantly telling you all the graphic ways that you're probably gonna get murdered. So, they don't have to show anything. They'll just be like, yep, they got you. Now you get to go through the process you've seen. Oh, he put- he reached in under the mouth- under his face flap and fed himself. Uh. So 
they just they're just wearing these horrible human masks. This one's less sound derived, but line of sight derived. Problem is, we have this fixed camera angle sort of thing going on, so figuring out his perspective is not always easy. I thought that was going to be clear. All right, so press this button, and run for it. I think. Press it. That'll make noise. Grab that key, grab that key, grab that key, right goddamn now. No! No, I missed the table. Grab that key! <laughs> Go! Get in the elevator. Yes, we're clear. Get in the elevator. Oh boy. You almost get like an old school Resident Evil feel from some of the moments where you where you struggle with the controls, and you kind of have the feeling like maybe they're intentionally making the controls kind of iffy, just to make these parts more stressful. No, stop picking up the thing. Ah, uh, ah, uh, hiding. Do not notice. Okay, I don't think I can even reach that, can I? Not climbing up there. There we go. Uh, what am I putting myself into? Oh! Oh, it's the garbage. That's... probably ranks pretty high on the places I'd want to be, honestly, unless the whole thing gets incinerated or crushed or something. I pl grab the plunger? No? Who puts a plunger in the garbage? Oh yeah, that was a straightforward escape. Can I climb out of this? So that one is open. You're gonna get yourself some really nasty, foul-smelling garbage if all the water drains directly into it. <laughs> That's gotta just permeate the area. Hey, they're both here. Washing dishes. I think the left one is the wide-eye one, and the right one's the kind of glary-looking one. I think... It's hard to say from here. I can't see them both at once. I imagine there's just two that look kind of different, but they might there might be tons of them for all I know. Ah, uh, that one has a grate. Another grate. Oh yeah, that's the wide eye one on the left, because the one on the right with its glary has a weird triangle mouth. Suds. Oh. I thought I had a strategy. Yeah, I'm not... The, the, the exact mechanics of the stealth aren't always clear to me. This definitely seems to have the kind of pacing that something like Limbo had. So I wouldn't be surprised if, like, the moment I get used to the stealth mechanic of this particular enemy, it'll go away and then get replaced by another one. I'm like, yay, I figured it out. Oh. And now that skill is useless to me. I bet that's what happens. Let's go over here instead, because doing that in the middle of the base was a bad idea. I think it might be less line of sight, or even light versus dark, and more just go hide in one of the designated hiding spots whenever someone's not looking- whenever you want to sneak by. You change locations? This seems like a scripted segment, kind of. Yeah, they all- they both move, but they didn't do that last time. Just sneaking over here. Keep going. No one's over here. Uh, find a way out. Just find a way out. Grab the lever. Push buttons and move things! Oh, that's gonna get me in trouble. Oh, I can't climb up that? No! You don't see me. I'm, invis I'm invisible. 
You can't see me, I don't exist. But now I've moved, now the hooks are turned on. But now I need to get to, up to the hooks probably to go through the room. Which probably means reverse. Yeah, I probably need to go stealthing backwards to the same place, right? Yeah, those hooks are not going to be in line, in a range of any kind of jumps I can do. They're way up there. You suspicious of something? Oh, it's because of the uh, stuff on the floor I stepped on, huh? Gotta be careful. We don't want to become reconstituted meats. Or really reconstituted anything. Uh, yeah, there's just dirty floor everywhere to trap me. Basically. All these flakes and stuff that you can step on that would crunch. Oh, I bet you I have to- I- I probably have to climb that tower of, uh, dishes to get up there. That's probably the one thing that reaches high enough for me to jump. Are you gonna patrol back? Yep. Oh. Not quite. He's hanging out over there now. Not really sure what to do next here. I'm just gonna give it a go. There we go. Get up there. Oh no. Oh no. Go, go, go. Please don't throw cleavers at me. I bet you that's what's gonna happen. Oh no. He's got a plunger. I don't like that. No. Oh, there- oh, there's way more of them. There's way more of them than I thought there were. He was gonna grab me, wasn't he? Oh, no! No, 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 I'm gonna hide it back here, you can't- oh! Damn it. Definitely getting a few- Definitely getting a few deaths from just not being able to see what's going on around me. I totally thought there was like a tunnel there that I could run through and that would like throw them off. I was like, ah, oh, they can't quite reach me past that, and if, so if I run for that, they're screwed. Oh, jeez. Rude. Go, go, go. Uh? No? No, 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 no. Yeah, I mistakenly thought that there was a passage under that crate because of the dark spot. I'm like, oh yeah, I'll slip through there and they'll never catch me. Oh, I just died, didn't I? going. So that time what happened is I pressed right, but I guess I didn't press the right right. It was like slightly off from how right I was pressing, and so I, uh, I fell off the ledge. That probably would be a good time for the game to snap into like a, like snap into 2D controls when you're walking on a, on a pipe like this. Right, let's, let's try not to fall off. Careful. I'm managing to die in moments where the, the developers probably never even intended for you to be able to die. <laughs> I'm just that good at video games, y'all. I can invent new and exciting deaths. Why is there a hole down? I don't like how there's a hole down here on my level. Oh, am I still in 3D where I can fall off? I think I, can, I, think I am. Yeah, you can kind of loop around. Oh, that could go bad. Look at the size of that chain! Just in case you weren't sold on the sheer scale of how tiny we are in this game, jeez. Whoa, sunlight. Are those all the little... Are those all the chef people? Or is that just what they all look like? 
all these fat chef people all load their, themselves up in here and then get fed children, basically. Oh. And then I died. <laughs> well, that happened again. Yeah, the perspective for platforming is weird. They, they, uh, they're prioritizing framing the shot that looks really striking visually over, like, clarity of platforming stuff. There we go. Ooh, I guess we don't want to go up. I mean, we don't want to go down, I mean, because that's just the ocean, and we've we've derived that that's bad, apparently. Oh, they're coming from another boat. Dang it. I was like, ooh, people are boarding. We should get off this thing and escape. I don't care if you're afraid of water. Just get to shore, damn it. But that's just another boat of the same monsters, probably. It's way smaller than ours. Ours looks bizarre. Like, that thing just looks like a boat. This thing looks like some sort of horrible monstrosity. And if, if that, in fact, this thing over here looks like the mouth, like the weird hair lip looking, like, slack mouth that one of the chefs has. The whole thing's surreal. Cool water effect, by the way. Go, going up against the water. I mean, going up against the side of the boat. Those seagulls exist in this universe? So it's some kind of Earth-like setting. Oh! Oh look! Oh, never mind. My bad. <laughs> I had a brief moment of- Oh look, they put an invisible wall here to make me not fall. They did not. And now I- I get to do the entire climbing section again! Oh, I jumped past it! It's one of the interesting little, uh, back and forth tug-of-war matches that happen between cinematic games and, like, gameplay games, where it's, like, all about a platforming challenge or a, a combat challenge. Kind of like how you- there's quick-time events to make you feel like you're involved in a scenario, but if you fail a quick-time event, then you have to repeat it, and I question whether or not you're supposed to ever fail them. So are they all wearing faces? Masks? Not entirely sure what to think of these. They seem to vary. I think so I wonder if these are like classes of society or something. Some of them just seem to have shittier masks, basically. Or less human-like ma They're all shitty masks. But some of them have big, bloaty, nasty, horrible faces. And some of them don't even have that. They just have like a weird porcelain mask pl plastered over them that doesn't even look r remotely convincing. They look like one of the characters from Repo, the genetic opera. Or... More famously, the character who ripped off that, Handsome Jack. I'm pretty sure Handsome Jack from Borderlands is just a direct rip-off of the, uh... ...visual aesthetic of the character with the face tied on from, a uh, Repo the Genetic Opera. Alright, let's go meet the guests, why don't we? Everyone wants to eat us, cause we're just so gosh darn sweet! Not really encouraging, really. Not as much as it might seem like it is. So I'm waiting for the horror segment that capitalizes on the whole... the whole flame situation. Because so far I just use the flame periodically... to just sort of, uh... Just, just... make the game slightly more visible. Mostly for you guys, honestly. But sooner or later, I'm- oh, look at that. He just looks like a person. Like, sooner or later, I figure I'll have to use the flame in some pitch-black scenario where I have to navigate with the flame, but I have to turn it off to not get caught, and, like, figure out how to balance those. And that'll be freaky. Yeah, they're horrible looking. But she just looks like someone? Maybe a geisha or something? So they've placed her in a position of power being above and looking down on everyone. That seems to suggest that she's the one running this whole place. We're going for like an eastern design now? With some of this stuff? Between her design and these lights and stuff like that, this whole level kind of... Uh-oh. I did it again. <laughs> I did it again.
No. I feel bad for our protagonists whenever I screw up because they respawn just being remorseful and sad. Oh, I, wow, I landed on top of it that time. Based on which way the, the uh, ship is leaning, the jumps are massively different in length. Oh, a pie. I could do the nice pie. Preferably not made of babies, though. Baby pie is just too, you know, gamey. And not made of apples and cinnamon. Ah, <laughs> oh, great. Enjoy this visual. Let's go. They're eating. It's not even eating, like, well-prepared food. Ew. He's just, like, suckling on meat right now. <laughs> Uh-oh. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> kind of threw his whole table and just knocked me the hell out. Was it because I got- is it because I no I made him notice me? When the thing fell over? I have to get out of the way because he's gonna knock the table over there. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, that's horrible. Uh oh, he just eats you. Oh. What the fuck? How do I get past that? He's fast and huge. Can I not knock over the thing? Whoa! Whoa, physics! Oh, and it- oh. Okay. Some weird stuff happened there. I- I sent that bottle to space. So he always knocks that table into you, I guess. So then where- do I hide somewhere? I don't really have a plan. Oh, that time it fell over again. I can't- I can't climb this. Where do I go? Okay. I don't really get a lot of time to survey the room and look around. So it's like, I just- I walk in and just die instantly, and I don't get to, like, see what's around me and- Oh! Dang it! Alright. Gonna run for it. Oh, you still got me! Jeez. He's grabbing me through tables now. I keep thinking maybe I can grab the bottle and make it not fall over and then he won't freak out. But, he, but the character seems to respond poorly to me trying to grab the bottle. Dang it! Alright, well that didn't work out. Running. Uh, that's really creepy. Go away. Did that work? Am I getting away? Okay. I can't tell when it's a chase segment or like a puzzle sometimes. I'm gonna go under here for a bit. Mind me. There's somewhere to go? Uh, I probably need to climb the plates, don't I? And, uh, and then climb on top of the horrible fat lady who's eating everything and, and just being miserable. Uh, uh. No, 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 no. No, no, no. No, no, no. Don't do that. Definitely don't do that. There we go. Oh, no. Oh, no. Maybe she'll fall backwards? That'd be kind of funny. <laughs> um, where am I going from here? Please don't notice me. They are so into this. This is really creepy. It's like the Skeksis feast from Dark Crystal where they're just like, just chomping away. Peace for a moment. Friend. All the survivors get triangle hats for some reason. What are you guys exactly? 
There's like vaguely naked little soggy gnome things. I'm not sure what they what they, what to make of their visuals. Oh, is there nothing here besides your salvation? Oh. Well, enjoy being here, I guess. I guess this is where he hangs out all the time. You should not follow me back out here. Do not follow me back out here. You stay there. Where am I going from here? Can't climb up that. I guess there must be something on top of it. There we go. That's horrible. Yep. We've gone full horrible. I'm gonna be on the table with them now? Or not? Well, that doesn't amount to much, does it? Do I swing this way? No. I can't climb up it or anything. I guess that's not what we're doing. Maybe I can platform over to the other stool from this one? Not gonna say it's a good idea, it's just I'm trying to figure out where I can continue. I think it is just this stool, but it seems like a terrible idea. Uh, am I gonna be in front of everybody? Uh. That's just disgusting. Uh, it's almost made grosser by the fact that he's not actually eating anything because like the game's constantly just jamming food everywhere. Like I don't think he's even eating any of them. Oh, nope. Oh. Oh. I eat the clothes.